Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on Supergirl Season 6. Today we're going to be talking about the trailer that is potentially coming very soon. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Okay, so Superman Lois aired last night. Super exciting. I highly recommend you guys go check out the episode, and if you've checked out the episode, go check out my review which posted late last night, so maybe some of you guys missed it out. But please be sure to go check it out because there's so many easter eggs and there's so much to break down and it turned out to be a long video, and I think you guys will really like it. Anyway, so, to do with Superman and Lois, it premiered last night, so episode 1 came out, and during episode 1, obviously like they do week by week, the CW operates in a way that, you know, they play 10 minutes of an episode, and then they break for ads. They play another 10 minutes, and then they break for ads again. And it goes on and on and on. But specifically on the CW, what they do is they promote their shows during those ad breaks. Because they know people are going to be watching, and people are going to be either muting during the ads, or they're going to have the ads on. And either way, they're going to see what is on the screen, right? And so... Last night they played the Flash trailer like three times, which is to be expected considering that the Flash is returning in under a week now, which is obviously super exciting because the Flash is my favorite DC TV show after all, along with Supergirl, but nevertheless. So you see the Flash trailer is playing and it's playing between these ad breaks and then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, there is this promo that drops and it's to do with Stargirl. And so it's really interesting because I was not expecting this at all. I don't think anyone was expecting it because right now it's February. Obviously, it's near the end of February and we're heading into March. And we still don't know when Supergirl, Stargirl, Legends of Tomorrow, when those shows are coming out. However, they just dropped their first look at Stargirl Season 2 last night. So this gives precedent to say that Supergirl is probably going to be dropping a trailer pretty soon. And you could expect it next week. I'm going to say, my theory right now, potentially during the Flash's premiere, it may drop a little promo to say, Supergirl Season 6 coming this summer. And now normally I wouldn't make such a far-fetched thing like, oh, Supergirl's just going to randomly drop a promo to promote it's coming into the summer. But considering they just did this with Stargirl out of nowhere, it got me thinking, they are definitely going to plan something like this sometime very soon and what's coming next well we have the flash premiere so why won't they pair the flash with supergirl obviously you just had the recent announcement in the films that the flash and supergirl are going to be crossing over and in the arrowverse the flash and supergirl together melissa and grant are the greatest pairing of all and the most beloved i would say out of all the heroes from other shows so they have a similar audience right so why not drop that promo to say supergirl season six come in this summer or come in the spring, whenever they're gonna drop the season. And by dropping the promo, that means that basically, they're not only hyping people up by saying Supergirl is coming on this day or, you know, around this time, but they're also dropping a first look. And I thought that was very smart because I did not expect the CW to go down this route where they literally just drop it out of nowhere and it's really short, but it got everyone excited. Everyone was talking about Stargirl last night after Superman and Lois. Obviously, Superman got a lot of the conversation, but still, loads of people were talking about Stargirl because everyone was shocked that they dropped that trailer last night. And so, considering that Stargirl is set to come out around the same time as Supergirl, we don't know specifically any days, but it's said that they're going to be mid-season shows, so that means mid-season starting from January, so that was the mid-season, and then they go the mid-season of the mid-season, if that makes any sense. And that's around the time of May slash April slash June. So more than likely it's going to be June and that is classed as summer. So what they just dropped last night with Starco is coming this summer. That's what they teased. So obviously summer could mean June, July or August, whatever you classify summer as. But just going by how they premiered Stargo last year, they dropped it around May time. So I'm presuming it's going to be somewhere around there. And then along with this, that means that Supergirl is going to be dropping around there. Obviously there were some rumors that it was going to be coming out early, I think in April. But I don't think April is going to happen. I think it's going to be May. I don't think it's going to be as late as June, although it could be the start of June, but we'll have to wait and see. But it does seem like a season 6 promo of Supergirl 
is very likely to come soon considering there is precedent for this already with what they dropped last night. So yeah, crazy stuff and I can't believe it actually happened but yes it did. And let's move on to a few other things before we head towards the end of this video. So we got some more Supergirl stuff. So along with the Superman and Lois premiere last night, Bitsy Turlock, who plays Lois Lane, of course, did a Instagram live with Entertainment Weekly, but she was also joined by Azzy Tesfaye from Supergirl, who plays Kelly, obviously. And it was a great video. I really enjoyed it. I watched the whole thing. And basically, she dropped like a bunch of stuff. And we've got a video probably coming tomorrow, I would guess to do with Supergirl crossing over with Superman Lois because Melissa apparently wants to cross over with Superman Lois if they can this season. So that's pretty much confirmation that if yes, things get better, we're gonna probably see a crossover. So turn on notifications to not miss out on that video tomorrow because we're gonna be breaking it all down. But anyway, so the extra Supergirl stuff is that Azzy is in fact still writing her episode. Her episode is episode 12 of season six of Supergirl. And so she's currently on the fifth draft, so she's been working on it for just over a month, I think. And obviously this is kind of usual, but obviously it's not that much in the light. We don't get told about this because the writers don't advertise it. But obviously because she's an actor, she's going to be in interviews and she's going to get us. So she's getting there, she is very close to finishing, and she's having a good time. And we know, because she confirms in this interview that she's going to be working on more projects so it'll be interesting to see if she does come back because even in the interview as he talks to Bitsy and Bitsy is like you should totally come back and work on Superman Lois obviously do like a guest spot but also write and work behind the scenes on it so maybe a David Ramsey is going to be happening and just so happens David Ramsey is directing her episode which is episode 12 which is super exciting but Maybe she is going to do a David Ramsey and maybe she will come back to the Arrowverse. I feel like they're not going to get rid of Azzy. I feel like they want her back because she's a very valuable person for the CW, I feel like. And so, yeah, David is working on this episode after he directs Superman and Lois Season 1, Episode 7. And after he finishes that Superman episode, which is coming up very soon, he's going to go straight on to The Flash. I'm not sure what episode he's directing of The Flash, but he is doing that next. And then after The Flash, he's going over to Supergirl episode 12, sometime in March, they said. So he's going to be busy and he's going to be hopping around on all of these different shows. Also, as he touches on Supergirl's final season, and she said that the cast and crew are a little bit bummed out that they can't all be, you know, together and just celebrating the fact that they're shooting the final season because they have to stay two feet apart and all these strict precautions are in place. So obviously that is natural and I think it's a shame that Supergirl's final season is during the pandemic and hopefully by the time of August things relax and things get better in the whole world to do with the pandemic and then maybe, just maybe, towards the end of their filming they get to be around each other and have a good time and I think that's all we all want. Also, Azzy had a few teasers for Supergirl fans because with Supergirl ending she was asked, you know, how does it feel? And she said that they're all pretty excited. Not because the show is ending, but because of the back half of the season, which apparently is super, super exciting. Obviously, Azzy is working on an episode in the back half, but she also teases that a lot of stuff is going to happen that fans want to happen, especially two of her character. But that is going to be mixed up into another video over the course of the next few days because we got a few videos to do with Supergirl planned out, including what she said to do with the back half of the season because those teasers are very interesting and has a lot of implications about what is to come. But yeah, so I'm really excited about all of this, especially due to the fact that Stargirl got a promo last night completely out of nowhere. So maybe, just maybe, we will get some sort of inside look at Supergirl Season 6 hopefully with the premiere of The Flash. I'm not saying it's going to happen 100%. I'm not confirming that, so take it with a grain of salt. But I think it's reasonable to assume that they might be planning something like this for Supergirl, considering what happened last night during Superman and Lois. But for now, please be sure to go check out my review of Superman and Lois as it premiered last night, and I did drop that video very late, so maybe some of you guys missed out on it. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. Please be sure to leave a like and a comment on this video. Subscribe if you're new and turn on notifications so you don't miss any videos. But for now, I'll catch you guys later. Goodbye.
Icy Road.